Oh, so many hands. <laughs> We're done! Yay! Yeah. Roll! Roll? Roll! He doesn't want to roll. He only knows must bang first, okay? But you must ask him to shake hand first. Hey! 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 So many hands! <laughs> so many hands! How do you know I had to go? Pre-sewing class fun. <laughs> okay, everybody say hi! <laughs> so before we start, okay, I just want to make sure to, to let you know, okay, that everyone's, um, everyone's sewing basics is very different, okay? Some of us have to work a little bit harder to get to what we want to. Some of us come a little bit more natural and that is perfectly fine, okay? But the other thing that I want to make sure that you, you know and understand by the end of today is that I want to make sure that you are set up for success. And what I mean by that is, okay, even if you're naturally very talented, even if you naturally can sew very well but your machine sucks or your machine setup is completely off, that's going to hinder your sewing progress, you're going to feel very frustrated and you're not going to get anywhere because I've been there, I've done that and it doesn't matter age, it doesn't matter race, it doesn't matter anything the moment you're frustrated with your sewing machine, done okay? so I want to make sure to eliminate that because there's a lot of things to think about when you're sewing okay? when you, of course when you're doing clothes, okay? a lot of pattern making that one has a lot of thought process that goes into it which we also have workshops for um, but Ultimately, you know, where we are starting is I want to make sure that your basic today is completely right. They don't even have to think about it, you can throw it out the door so that you can move on to so whatever it is that you want. Whatever crazy project, I'm supporting you. You got inches, you got CM. Mm -hmm. Okay, what's the difference? Now, bear in mind that different um every dressmaker, okay, every service have their preference. Like if Zarin say, okay, I want inches. Zoe say I want CM. Lin say one inches. I say like CM. Who's right, who's wrong? No mm. one. Mm. Right? Mm. It's your own preference. Mm. But, but, <laughs> the only thing I want you to make sure of to see is that one inch is equals to? 2.5. Yes, 2.5 cm. Now, the reason why I say this is because there are many measuring tapes out there. Mm. One inch is not equal to 2.5 and therefore really? everything is wrong. Yes. yes. Oh. Having the proper measuring tape is like very important. It's so important. Yeah. Sometimes you take one measuring tape, then you take another measuring tape. Hey, how come different measurement different? Yeah. Oh. Wow. Mm. In the first place, it cannot be wrong. So always remember, Zeri, one inch is equals to two point five. Two point five what? Yes. yes. <laughs> very good. Okay. Yeah. You wanna pull it up? Wow. Yeah, this one nice. I want this one. Okay, you know what fabric this is called? Mesh. Organza. Ah. Organza. What is this? Am I supposed to take it out? That's ostrich feathers. Yeah. Yes. I think we stick it out. Ostrich feathers? Okay, later we stick one on your head. <laughs> we can stick one on your feet here, okay? We get up here, then you can move around. Okay? Okay? What fabric is this? Smash the little chiffon. Little chiffon. Yeah. Okay, before you do that, okay, I want you to make sure that you have the wrong side up. Why? Wrong. Okay, wrong side. Wrong <laughs> side up. Good question, Lin. Why? Because you must always cut on the wrong side of the fabric. No. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> because we need to do marking. Marking? Very good, <laughs> Zoe! Wow! Yeah, Zoe's yeah. so nice! Yeah. Okay. So I want you to measure here, to here, here, to here, 16, 16. Measure a few points. Can you do that? Can you measure a few points? So you take your... Okay, I'll show you. Okay, you take your chalk. 16cm, you mark one here, one on here. Okay, move. Okay, do a few, oh. not too far away, okay? Then 16 cm. Can you do that? Okay, do that first. There you go. Then after you mark all the points, use your ruler to join the dots. Okay? 
Now, grab a pair of scissors. Okay. so big. Okay. Before you do that, can you put some petal weights in the fabric in between when you draw the, the rectangle? Here? No, inside. Yes. Correct. All around. Try and put more, okay? Din Okay, nice. So when you're cutting away to make sure that the base is on the table. Okay? So when you're cutting, okay, what I want you to do. Okay, is I want you to make sure that you're going according yeah, to this line cut, here. Cut this side. Ah, okay. okay, and as you cut down, okay, cut all the way down here, and then I want you to open. You see this again? Move all the way to where you cut. Can you understand? Okay, so I want you to start here first. Ah, yeah, then here, then here, then here. Okay. Yeah. Okay, you can try. From here over there. Now, I'm gonna explain this over here. Okay, on koa. Yeah. Okay, here. Wait, let me make it less clear. Now, see, on off is over here. For this machine. On off. Yeah. On off, okay? Mm. Okay, this is on. Now, then the other thing is, okay, you're going to see that this over here is called the tension down. Mm -hmm. Can you remember? Mm. Tension down, okay? This over here is called the stitch length. You want the stitch to be one, two, three, four, five, or you want it one, two, three, four, five. How long you want the stitch to be. Can you remember? Mm. Tension, stitch length, okay? Mm. So, Zemi, can you choose a thread that's cotton polyester for yours? What is it? Is it this? You see, yes, correct. But you choose a colour that you like that matches as much as possible, okay? So, I'm using two stitches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you sew two, two stitches, one. You're not going to do this in your actual one. You're going to do this in one stitch. So, so, are you okay with your back stitch now? Let's go, well done. Dung 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 dung. Just just scratchy. Woo. <laughs> okay, so you're going to put this under here, same thing, put her down, <laughs> needle down, correct? Yeah. Okay, then you're going to step to come forward, right? One, two, three, back stitch. I want to go as close to the end of the fabric as I can, but don't go over the fabric, okay? How are you doing? Fine. Are you videoing the chair? Isn't she amazing? Yeah! Oh my gosh, I love your videoing. Ooh, very good. Okay. Demi, can I tell you one thing? Don't hold the back part. Yes! How you know no, I'm it's gonna easier say to control. that? Okay, okay, okay. Go ahead yeah. then. You can try that. <laughs> okay. So, method is basically... Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay, very okay. nice. Okay, can release it? Undo the flap this way? Yeah. Okay. Right, very nice. Okay. okay. Stop! Stop! No, but the, the needle is holding the fabric <laughs> And go. Good. Okay, I want you to try and go slightly closer to here before you backstitch, okay? Try, okay? Whoa! It's trying your scrunchie. Wow! Nice. Wow, Zemi, yours feels nice and tight. You want to wear yeah. Right? Nice. It's just nice. Ooh, Very nice. Eh? Yeah. Good job. <laughs> Yay! Good job. Wow. Well, Done. <laughs> Say yay to mommy. Yay. See your shoes. <laughs> so shiny. Goldie, goldie. <laughs> but then with the scrunchie. Oh, yay. Yay. Yes. Yay. Well done. Yay. Yeah, well done. <laughs> you. Can you see you? <laughs> Do you like the scrunchie mommy made for you? Uh. Are you going to share it, mommy? Uh. Yeah. I hope so. Ooh, look at scrunchy. Look at your scrunchy. I love it. Whoa. Look at that scrunchy. 
I'm gonna take a photo so you can see. Whoa. We're done! Zuri, where's your scrunchie? In my head. <laughs> <laughs> so I just want to say that that was an amazing class. I think um, every one of them had different levels of sewing and also at the same time um, they all have their own goals, you know, like Lynn wants to start her own scrunchie business, her own business selling printed t-shirts and stuff like that, so that's amazing. And uh, Zoe wants to make dance costumes for her, her two girls. And uh, Zoe just wants to make scrunchies, you know, and have fun with that and wear them for dance. So, you know, it, that's amazing because I think what I really want to do is I really want to support anyone who wants to learn sewing. So I really love that and I appreciate that. And I'm very thankful for this class today and uh, for everyone who is a part of Free Movement. I love you guys and see you very soon. Bye.